Hello everybody and happy Monday. It is Monday evening, the first official evening of our extended break and I'm excited to announce that I will be doing videos every single day. These could be writing warm-up videos, reading videos, a couple of Minecraft ones, the kind of you know the things that a lot of the students are into so anyone is welcome to to watch even if you're not in my class but i hope you guys enjoy so the first one tonight we are going to do a writing editing warm-up little activity so what you need you need to grab a piece of paper a pencil and you're going to write these down to fix these sentences okay so you might notice that there are some errors around here okay i want you to fix those think about what you know as fifth grade writers and kind of what we know as sentence writers, right? So I'm going to have you pause the video and you can write these down. No, you, you actually have to pause the video. But no, I'm, I'm serious. You can't just stare at the screen. So pause the video like to write them down. Okay, thank you. So now that you've paused the video to write these down, yes, yes, you, you really have to write these down. I'm not going to do the work for you. Okay, thank you. So we're going to look at sentence number one here, okay? So Fred Wade, I noticed something, but before I jump into that, let's read the sentence. I hope that my students are washing their hands, stated Miss Adderley. Okay, notice the capital I. Okay, check your work. Did you capitalize that I? Okay, I hope that my students are washing their hands, stated Miss Adderley. Okay, something we learned in class is that dialogue. Remember, dialogue is when someone is talking. Um, a common mistake I see a lot of students use is they'll put quotation marks just like this. Okay, remember, quotation marks only go around the this parts in the story that you are speaking, right? So right now, it looks like it says, I hope that my students are washing their hands, stated Miss Adderley. Okay, I'm not yelling or stating, stating Miss Adderley, so I'm not going to put quotation marks around that part. I'm only going to have to put a comma quote here. Okay, so a comma quote, not sure why it's looking a little weird. There we go. So remember comma quotes if I'm stating something. Okay, I hope that my students are washing their hands. Okay, I hope you corrected that to there because there, the T-H-E-I-R, is that ownership, right? It's their hands. Okay, the other there that I just fixed meant over there, right? So make sure that's correct. And, of course, we capitalize the M in a name, period, and my name. Okay, there's one more thing, and adding that period. Perfect. Give yourself a star if you got that right, and give yourself a star if you fixed it all to be right. Everyone gets a star. So... Next student, sorry, next sentence. Be sure to read your books every day, every single day, screamed Miss Adderley. Okay, well, first of all, like I said in the last one, I'm not saying this whole sentence, right? I'm only saying that be sure to read your books every single day. This word right here, do you think I have a period, comma, or an exclamation mark? Okay, an exclamation mark, right, because I'm screaming that, right? So, fixing that. Putting the quotes around there, capital B at the beginning, at the beginning of a sentence. Hmm, your books. Okay, remember this stands for you are. Is that right? No, it is not. Your books, right? That ownership piece, kind of like there. Your books every day. Okay, screamed Miss Adderley. Remember, capitalize my name. Perfect, I see you did that there. Um, I hope you did, because we just went over the first one. So, there we go, period there. Okay, last one, like, remember, this one is a little different. This one starts with that dialogue tag. Miss Satterley yelled, have no fear, because I will be posting writing warm-up videos as well as other fun videos every day. Well, this one's interesting because it's starting with my, me yelling something. Okay, so again, always do that capital letter. Okay, Miss Satterley yelled, okay, this is the moment, people, that you've all been waiting for. You're going to have to, this is going to blow your mind right now. A lot of people will do this. Sorry. And leave it like that. Okay, my friends, this is really sad. I need to grab tissue. And this is sad. There's no comma. People forget to use commas. Comma quote is what I tell you guys all the time. Comma quote, comma quote, comma quote. Okay, Miss Adderley yelled comma quote. Okay, it's technically comma space quote, but it's always capital, right? Comma quote, have no fear because, um, first of all, um, that is not right, people. Because I, capital I, will be posting writing. Okay, a lot of people have noticed spelling writing this way. It's actually just like that, writing. 
Okay, writing warm up videos. So writing warm up could be capitalized because it's the name, a uh, proper noun of a of a video. That you know, I could do that if it like. Yep, writing warm up videos as well as other fun videos every day. Okay, period there. Um, I think. Let's look this over. Oh, um, period quote right there. Okay, so let's check these over. Good writers and readers always check their work. So I hope that my students are washing their hands, stated Miss Adderley. Looks good to me. Next one, be sure to read your books every single day, screamed Miss Adderley. Next one, Miss Adderley yelled, comma, quote, have no fear because I will be posting writing warm-up videos as well as other fun videos every day. Add that other quote there. Okay. Looks good. So there, remember, our learning target today had to do with using dialogue and using quotation marks correctly. So remember those comma quotes and those correct theirs and yours. Okay, perfect. I had fun, and I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll be posting more later. Peace out, be awesome, be safe, and throw that kindness like confetti every day. See ya!